This is Shock, and we're going to be taking this motorcycle on the freeway. And I have some really good news for you. We've updated the website. I got some free stuff for you, free software, free games, lots of free tools. And we have a update on Shock Radio. Now, this is an SV1000 motorcycle. It's my favorite one that I've had so far. Um, we're going to be talking about Shock Radio as I take it on the freeway, but I haven't really done any upgrades to it except uh, the zero gravity windscreen. The previous owner updated the grips to make them uh, bigger grips. And I think that's it. Um, new I'm just fogging up. Hold on. Believe it or not, it's kind of cool out here in California right now for August. Brand new tire. And then this part right here comes off and you there's a seat attachment that looks like this smaller and you can put it on here but um when i don't have a passenger on i'll i'll put this on but this comes off um and let's get this show on the road you guys ready to ride i have a lot to tell you you're going to get some free things out of this so hang on just be patient we're going to be getting on the motorcycle and um i'm going to be sharing with you some new shows at shock radio show that you may not know of some new radio shows that we did hey and let's get on you ready now you know what i always say guys why do we take the motorcycle because four wheels may move the body but two wheels moves the soul so let's go we're hands free check out the helmet We're in the Scorpion helmet today. First, let's start it up. Get the puppy warmed up here, get some oil through it. And we're started. Always make sure the kickstand's up. Kickstand's up. Put on the shift gloves. Now, have to make sure the Velcro sticks here. I was um, doing a video the other day and this guy goes, hey, you, I have the same watch. I go, oh, you shop at Walmart. <laughs> Someone got this for me as a gift because it matches the motorcycle a little bit and the gloves. Okay, you guys ready? This is gonna be great. We're gonna be hanging on tight as we go onto the freeway. Now, you wanna hang on tight as we launch onto the freeway. You know why? Because if you don't hang on tight, you're like, whoa, and you fall off because it's like riding a rocket. So, I have a list of things I'm gonna talk about we did a radio show on how to survive a nuclear war. Believe it or not, it is survivable unless you're in the epicenter, but how to avoid the fallout and stuff. I had a radio show with Saunders X 2618. He's a famous Christian street preacher on YouTube. He talks about him preaching at satanic concerts and the guy is gutsy and he talked about them throwing bottles at him and hitting his head and stuff. I did a, um, pro-life radio show with Pastor George and his friends and mine and it was excellent now you can click below this video when you go there look on the right on the top of the page and it'll say music and podcast music podcast and click that and you can watch all these shows and they're free to download in mp3 uh, every computer plays mp3s so you, if you have an mp3 player you could also put them on your mp3 player and i'm not talking little 10 minute shows we do shows that go on for over an hour and they're awesome now i also did a show with the world famous the guy's been on tv he's an author ray comfort very very nice guy he's actually very intelligent one of the most intelligent people i've met very very intelligent um i think if a lot of people should listen to that show. He's he's brilliant. One of our top shows was a Christmas show. Let me go through a few more and then we'll give it some throttle. 
One of our top shows was a Christmas show we did. I actually did a radio show on Christmas. I was surprised a bunch of people showed up and that was one of our top shows. I took live calls. There's another show called The Madness of Atheism, which is our top show. And what I did, unscripted, unrehearsed, is I took live calls from atheists and I challenged them to provide proof and evidence that atheism was accurate and correct. Some of them got violently angry, very upset. You will hear them cussing me out on the radio. Then we had a live debate. We had people call in from the evolution side and we had evolution versus creation debate and all types of stuff. So let's go. You ready? Here we go. We are going to get on the freeway. Hang on, folks. This is the fun part. Remember what I told you? Hang on right here. <laughs> okay. We're all set. Now, I want to show you something. Look, my temperature is starting to get kind of hot out here now. The sun's coming out. Look at that bird right there. The temperature is at 219 Fahrenheit. Can you see that? 220 now. As I start going, get more air into the radiator. Oh, that nice cool breeze feels good. As I start going, I get more air into the radiator. You're going to see it cool down. We're up to 220. Watch. So watch, I'll show you as I get on the freeway how it cools down. And okay, we're all set. Now I go to neutral here, because I'm at a light. Yeah, a lot of you guys don't know, I I uh, do a radio show on uh, special events all, like Christmas and Easter and of course the National Atheist Day, April 1st. I'll do radio shows and I take live callers and you never know what they're going to say. <laughs> yeah, I really like the idea of live callers. It's fun. Okay, so here we go. Getting on the freeway. I got about two or three more lights. Now I'm up to uh, down to 212 Fahrenheit on the temperature. So I can't wait to get on so we can cool this puppy off. My fan goes on about 240. 15. Okay, well, now it's at 214 Fahrenheit. We got one light, two, we got two lights and the 215 Fahrenheit. I hope this light doesn't catch me. Hold on, I gotta look up. Upshifting to third. 213 Fahrenheit. Watch, it's gonna start going down now. I have this light here and one more and we're gonna launch onto the freeway. Now it's going down, 211 Fahrenheit. This light always catches me, so let's give it throttle. All right, not this time, my buckaroo. I got that light. It always catches me, 207 Fahrenheit, 206. It's going down. All right, here we go. Hang on, remember what I told you? This is where we launch. Motorcycle cop right there, look, right in front of me. Why don't I fly up to him going about 120? What do you think? No! I don't want to do that. He's gone. Boy, that truck's flying right there. Might be pulling someone over. See him right there? He's weaving in and out. Looks like he might. Okay, so let's tell you about the show. Um, he's getting off the freeway. Guys, I've done some, yep, he's pulling someone over. Let me see. No, he's not. I thought he was. Looks like his light was on, just his turn signal. Um, guys, I have done some really entertaining shows. I've had people on my shows, remember, here's how you go there, you go to shotgunout.net right below and click music podcast on the right hand side. Boy, the cops are out full force today. Um, you know there was a uh, an article on how some of the cops were saying they were getting pressured to write more tickets because of the, what's this guy doing, what's good in the left lane, because of California's shortfall of revenue. I feel sorry for the cops, to be honest with you, you know. They want to be out there catching the bad guys and the state's trying to turn them into tax collectors. 
So let's talk about some of the shows I've had Ray Comfort on, where he goes through, he talks about where he uh, meets with evolutionists and he asks them questions, they don't know how to answer it. Um, we've had atheists call into my show and I asked them to provide proof and evidence that atheism is accurate and correct. And it's absolutely hilarious how they don't know how to answer it. Um, I did a very serious show, uh, one of my favorites, a pro-life radio show. And one of the highlights was one of my friends uh, who's pro-life and he used to be an agnostic. Um, he gets his son on the show, you know, his little boy, and his little boy starts talking, and it really is a heartwarming moment um, over here. We had um, a lady that represents the pro-life organization. Um, I even had liberals on the radio show, and the reason why I had them on is they too were pro-life. So it was awesome, because I'm a conservative, you know, it was awesome to have some type of agreement where we both can rally around something good and something just, which is the pro-life movement. One of the shows also that I did on Christmas, you'll see it there, remember, go to shotgunout.net, click music and podcast, and I'm going to tell you about the free things I'm giving you too. And when you click music and podcast, look at this thing right here. You'll see all the radio shows there. Guys, trust me. I know you're here on YouTube and you're used to watching videos and stuff. The radio shows are much better than even watching a video. I know you might be thinking, how could an audio be better than a video? Well, see, I take live calls from people. And some of the things are so controversial that we talk about I couldn't put it here on YouTube where they'd false flag it. And so what I like about the radio show, I could be a little more open, you know, and, and talk uh, without every one of my videos getting false flagged, you know. Because we know YouTube's like totally pro-atheist, anti-Christian. We, we clearly know that. So, um, let's see what else I can tell you. Oh, let's talk about the free stuff. Remember, when you go to shotgunnow.net, right below here, click Music Podcast. Listen to one show, and you'll be hooked. Listen to the show, um, for example, How to Survive a Nuclear War. Now, when I uh, listened to this guy in the show, because um, this guy was on another show besides mine, the show was so awesome, I contacted that show and asked if I could broadcast it on my show, and they said yes. And this guy talks about how you really, as long as you're not in the epicenter of a nuclear attack, how you could really avoid uh, the dangers of a nuclear attack. And he talks about how to seal off your house, how to shelter. He also talks about how to get away from the fallout in other words, you don't just go directly away from it, you kind of go sideways away from it so the wind doesn't overtake the fallout. Okay, so promise me guys, you've got to check that out. You will love the show. Shotgunnow.net, what a musical podcast. I would suggest listen to the nuclear war one first and you'll be hooked. How to survive a nuclear war. After that, you will be a loyal shock radio listener. Now, I promised you some free things. Go right here below, shockandl.net, same place, except right next to music and podcast, it says free stuff. So click where it says free stuff. We got free games, we got free software, we got free antivirus programs. I gotta get over here in the right lane. We have, um, we have free software to back up your entire YouTube channel. You know, what were to happen if your YouTube channel were to get false flagged or false DMCA'd and you lose everything, you can back up your entire YouTube channel. Everything's free, no cost. So listen to Shock Radio. You will be a fan. If you, Matter of fact, if you go to blogtalkradio.com and you type in atheism, our show is on the very first page as one of the top shows. 
for atheism Christianity. God bless you guys. I love you. This is Shock.